Since the 1970s, nuclear power has declined as countries slowly phase out their old reactors in favor of other sources such as fossil fuels and green renewables. Fossil fuels are proven to be environmentally disastrous due to their carbon emissions, and renewable sources are highly reliant on the weather or their location. Nuclear power is probably the best solution which minimizes climate change while also being reliable. However, old nuclear reactors do have its own set of problems, such as high capital investment, high waste output, and some safety concerns. The future, however, promises vast safety improvements, lower costs, and increased efficiency, which leads to fewer harmful radioactive waste with the new fourth generation of reactors. A type of Gen 4 reactor are SMRs. SMRs, or small modular reactors, produce less megawatt electric and are, as their name suggests, smaller than the current reactors, which is why they can be deployed and transported to rural and remote areas. SMRs can also be mass-produced causing a decrease in the already lowered price compared to their full-size counterparts. Moreover, new technologies will allow us to use alternative fuels such as thorium instead of the more commonly used uranium, which has the benefit of producing less waste that also have a much shorter half-life. New technologies, together with the use of new materials and economical strategies, open new paths for future nuclear engineers. The future holds an infinite amount of possibilities for cheap and clean reactors and different market designs. For more information, we decided to ask someone with more knowledge in the field of SMRs. How do you see the future of SMRs? Is it feasible that in the future, every family will have an SMR in their backyard? Well, feasible, yes. Uh, will it be the case? I doubt. Um, but the main aspects of the SMR is that uh, they um, are flexible, so it's a flexible approach for nuclear energy. So I expect, uh, and we all expect in the, in the field, to have a small modular reactor all over the world. When do you see this idea become a reality on a large scale? So 2025 would be the target for a small modular reactor with the available technology, so with a pressurized water reactor. Uh, this is an ongoing uh, process. And 2035, 2040 probably for um, what is the generation for, so small modular reactor with new technology. With the future of SMRs being so bright, how appealing is this for future graduates like me? Well, I have good news for you because uh, you will have uh, a lot of chances. So um, I believe this will bring some, some new winds, so the, the wind will change and will be in favor of nuclear. So there will be on one side the um, engineering team will have to work for new uh, technology, so the, the small model reactor, but at the same time there will be also research and development required for the, the new um, application, new materials, uh, new fuels.